Hello viewers, I'm SB and welcome back to Rayman Origins where today we're gonna put an end to all these lousy clouds. You know what I'm saying? The big reveal, oh no. Who could possibly have foreseen the thing that's about to happen here? I mean, obviously me, cause I have played the game before and also I think I probably gave it away pretty obviously. So also all of you, Who could have foreseen? <laughs> In everyone else's defense, it was a pretty good, uh, pretty good disguise. Uh, oh, okay, this way, this way it is. Oh dear. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. <laughs> yep, not not good timing on the food. All right, usually they want you to go really fast. Here, I think it behooves us to wait a moment. Maybe even a moment more than that. Damn it. <laughs> the gap on that platform in particular is a really awkward length. There we go. Damn it. That one's so small, too. Those are all timed to be, like, as annoying as they possibly can be. Uh, mm, I'm pretty annoyed by that. That should have grabbed. Okay. I guessed, I guessed wrong which phase we were in there. Well, this isn't ideal. There we go. Darn it. Oh, really? All the way back here, are we? Well, that kind of sucks. I shouldn't have just gone for it. Yeah, the, um... The fact that this requires really awkward stop and start movement instead of, like... It would be much less bad if it was just go real fast but be perfectly timed. The fact that you have to keep stopping and then moving and then stopping and then moving is actually a real bummer. And it definitely should checkpoint you here at the part where the fight starts. Okay, do jump first. It, it reared back like it was gonna run. I thought, oh, maybe it's variable. Maybe we have to be prepared for any pattern. But no, it just moves in a way that is unintuitive to me. Interesting. You could probably just stay right in front of it and let the platforms come up and Hmm, I wonder. Wow. Okay, somehow I survived. So like, look at that, look at that rear back. That is an I'm about to run forward rear back if I've ever seen one. I remember, and then all the way back, and then in the middle. Oh, 
Maybe a little bit different than before. Oh! You can understand why I thought that pattern of striking every two feet would just continue, instead of stopping arbitrarily in the center of the room. This, uh, this section's kind of annoyingly designed. And also, it should definitely give you a heart. It does feel a little bit like the, um, the design ethos of this section has been make things as awkward as possible, just like as not smooth as they can be, which is not really how the game runs usually. Oh, I'm assuming we're gonna have to be up here. We have like a two two thirds of the way to a victory against each of the bosses. I can handle that for the most part, at least partially. For real though, a heart would be fantastic. up here chuckling that whole time? I'm not 100% familiar with the thing that I'm seeing. He did just try to kill, uh, so maybe with the attempted murder, I should have more of a response to, yep, yeah, okay. It's my fault, got sucked into another dance off. This always happens. They're very difficult to resist. Just ask Ronan the accuser. This is a pretty cool segment though. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Okay. Yeah. Oh, no. I lost my run. If I could just get close enough to the... Darn it. I thought I could maybe reach the edge of the up breeze there and save myself. I bet you can, though. Like you probably don't actually have to complete that whole uh, that whole upward segment. That's very fun. That's a cool design.
Oh god, oh god, okay. I do not love this loose saw blade. <laughs> Oh yeah, what's up now, nerd? Oh, you just kill yourself. Well, I, that seems extreme. Oh, never mind. Well, the good news is we know exactly what to do in such a situation. It is not clear to me what it is that we are shooting out of the mosquito, I'm realizing. Okay, I'm doing a terrible job of getting lums here. These guys have an awful lot of HP for the very small amount of loot they drop. There we go, I figured it out just before not figuring it out would have killed me. I do not think we're making any of the uh, any of the important thresholds on this one. I think I managed to pick, pick that up while we were still doubled. As much as I do not like the uh, fire spitting mosquitoes as an enemy that I have to like share the world with, I do think they're still a really cool visual design. Oh cool, good, great. Trying to get that thing to a uh, bad turning radius itself into the boss. I feel like breaking this would be pretty good. Oh. Real focused on the boss and real not focused on uh, me. And the missiles that I was placing myself directly in front of. Not even see what actually hit me there. I do not love got this, a lot of a lot of garbage to dodge. 
she says, running directly into all of the garbage. Come on, just break, just break. I couldn't back up fast enough to, um, to get out of the turn radius. That does seem like it's the thing to do, like, just get close to them. Um, but perpendicular to their line of motion and just have them turn and chase you forever. I wonder if pulling in a bomb and spinning it out at the airship would cause it to take more damage. Had the idea a moment later. Try to catch one of these missiles, I suppose. Damn it. Or that big that big bug was what I was going after. Okay, so grab the one that's between the pipes. Part that could take damage by such a small amount. to narrowly not kill any of those uh any of those groups of bugs it moves forward slowly enough that you have to not shoot after you try that i don't know it doesn't feel worth it to me okay. the extra missile portion is down i feel like we're doing okay damage Oh. Uh, perhaps the damage I'm dealing was not the most relevant factor after all. Okay, so everything's back to normal, and this time the undead are too beaten up to be mad about it? Question mark? Oh, there were lums to rescue. Okay, or electunes. I was gonna say, there were two areas where I thought maybe I had missed something. The, um, the updrafts after the robot version of the bird boss. Oh, no, no, these are just humans. In the updraft after the robot version of the bird boss. The updraft was a little bit wider than the platform, and it could have carried us up to the left of the platform above us. Would have been a good place for an Electune cage, although apparently it wasn't. But I do wonder if there was anything up there at all? Okay, and here's the other credits. We found the other credits. See, so this is what I was remembering last time, was that I was pretty sure you were able to get on the credits of the game and destroy them. Uh, and you totally can, just not the undead credits. Only the normal credits have the thing. Weird. No, surrender your electunes to me. Yeah, so there's that. Here's the thing. We've seen the credits already. We know, we know what the deal is with these. So I think that's it then. I think we have, in fact, seen the whole deal. I have not. 
managed to get enough Electunes for the final couple of skins because um, I'd have to go back and do a bunch of the, uh, the timed races and stuff. And I think it won't even show us what the absolute final skin is unless we... Yeah, unless we could afford the one before it. Well, I'll tell you, the only way to get 13 Electons at this point would be to timer run 13 separate levels. I don't think there's any level where we have more than one Electune missing. And uh, I think I'm not going to do that. <laughs> so that's going to be it for us for today. Thank you all so much for watching. We did it. We got through Rayman Origins. We managed to beat it. It gets pretty tough at the end, but also it's just a complete delight the whole time. Let me get back out to the glade here so that there's some music. Uh, yeah, that's it. Rayman Origins is a very good and fun game. Rayman Legends is also very good and fun. I think there are some things about it that are better. There are some things about it that are worse. It definitely lacks focus. Um, but it has a lot of cool, weird, new ideas and also some things that are probably going to get my videos slightly demonetized. Come back next time for the beginning of that. And we'll see you then.